Welcome back to Character Select. I just talked to my mom. She was nice. All right, so we're on to the last part of Gunpoint. Conway, this is Rook. I need your exper expertise. It's regarding my employee, Katie Collins. I have the recording you've been looking for. It's from a phone call in which Jackson threatens to kill Selena if she talks. It would be enough to get Katie Collins released and my husband arrested. Arrested. Would? I can't give it to the police. I didn't obtain it legally, so it's inadmissible. That's why I need you. I want you to copy it onto the police servers and leave a security hole for the press to find it there. Does that actually work? Will that get Collins off? I don't know. It's never been done before. But the East Point police would probably rather claim they were sitting on vital evidence than admit they don't know how it even got there. What does he even say exactly? Jackson, I mean it. If you say one word about this anywhere, you'll be dead before you leave the building. Yeah, that's not a good thing to say the night someone's killed. Have you told Collins? No, and I'd appreciate it if you didn't either. She has trouble coping with the guilt if I bring her a coffee. I don't want her to know I'm risking my career for her. You're okay with getting your husband arrested? He's gone dark. I can't believe he did it, and I don't know if he'll go down for it, but he put Collins in this situation so he can damn well take the fallout. Terminal you need to plant it on is on the first floor of the evidence warehouse in Union. I'm sending you a script that'll make it vulnerable. Once it's active, I'll tip off a journalist friend. All right. Whee! Yes, I know how to un... <laughs> you can also undo the last change you made in crosslink mode by pressing U. I cannot think of a third thing to tell you at this time. C cool. cool. Alright, so that's where we need to get to. Uh... Hi. Okay. That's the laptop. Alright, that's what I was trying to find. Whee! Ding. So we can use this to open the door, and then when the door opens, we can turn off the lights. And then when the light turns off, we can open that door and disconnect that so they can't turn the lights back on. Disconnect that so it doesn't set off an alarm. And that'll let us get over here. Okay. Bing! A whole bunch of shit just happened. See ya. Yeah, no, you can see me there. Cool. You didn't even fucking move. What a douchebag. Yo oh, I'm fully charged. Damn. Okay, so... It's possible to get through this game without actually punching anybody. But it's very difficult. Also, we can't deactivate this alarm, so... Oh, yes, we can. Now we can. But, rather than doing that, I kind of want him to come in here. Oh, my face. Yeah, I'll take that. You didn't see nothing. Okay, you did see something. <laughs> Jesus. Bam, bam, bam. Nope. This is gonna be tough, because it's very timing related. I mean, technically I don't actually have to do this non-lethally, but I want to. Your theory. So, I'm a jury. The defendant has no alibi, lives alone, and had access to all the security footage that was mysteriously erased for the night of the crime. And a reputable local business owner will testify that she was the last person left alone with the victim. How much do I care that she did it in a weird way? The Legato case is an easy close sell, and with your case log, you need an easy close. Just take the win. So that lets me get to here, and we will use this to open that door. Dun 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 dun. Planted. it. 
And we could go out the normal way, but we <laughs> do my super bad impression. It's Katie. I uploaded the data. Wait, what? I just got the call. They found her in her cell. The note just said she didn't want to be a burden. This is Jackson. The recording you have of me is real, but it's not the whole story. Selena and I were having an affair. When I told her not to say anything, I was trying to protect her. From whom? Intex. They blackmailed me to steal a large sum of money from Rook. I used their plan to take it, but I didn't give it to Intex. I was going to use it to blow the country with Selena. I was warning her to keep that to herself because I knew if Intex found out, they'd have her killed. If I'd known they were tapping my phone... The irony is not fucking lost. Why didn't Intex kill you too? They needed me to steal the money from Rook. We sometimes channel money through my firm to dodge tax, so for a day or two the money would be in my name. If I died before transferring it to Intex, the money would go straight back to Rook when she inherited my company. Why did you even tell Selena? She was a smart girl. She wasn't going to run off without, with me without knowing where the money came from. I knew she wouldn't be wild about stealing from Rook, but we didn't have much choice. Giving it to Intex would be worse, and doing nothing meant Intex would go public with the affair. Cut to the chase. I don't know how Rook got hold of that recording, but I know why she edited it, and I know that she, why she gave it to you. She knows about me and Selena, and she knows about the money. If I get arrested now, it defaults back to her. She's trying to frame me. So what do you want? The full recording. Public. Online. It proves the one Rook leaked was doctored, and it proves I didn't kill Selena. The terminal that recorded it logged the location of both phones at the time. I was out of town minutes before she died. That terminal is on Intex Op Center in Harvey Street. If you can get in, you can upload the full recording from there. I'll post it as an official job so I can pay you securely. Conway, it's Rook. Ignore Jackson. You don't even know what he said. Did he say the recording you have of me is real, but it's not the whole story? Yes. Intex are still bugging his phone and I've taken over their network. Damn. I know who killed Selena. I know exactly where he is now. And I know what will happen if that recording gets out. The killer will vanish forever. The only reason he hasn't disappeared already is that he knows Jackson's going down for it. As soon as the cops start looking for someone else, he's gone. Can't we just get the real killer? Then, le Or who is it? I'm withholding that you until you can secure Jackson's conviction. Can't we just get the real killer then leak the recording? You could, uh, you could if you knew where he was. I could if I wanted that recording leaked. But if Jackson broke out or gets out, I lose everything. The money he took broke our agreement, but it wasn't illegal. I can't get it back unless he's convicted. You want to let an innocent man go down to catch a guilty one? Not the word I would use. Jackson framed Katie Collins for Selena's murder, which led directly to her death. The fact that he also cheated on me and stole most of my capital just makes me less conflicted about destroying him. Point taken. So you want me to get Jackson convicted? How? The terminal at Intex that Jackson wants you to upload the recording from. I need you to get to it and wipe it instead. Jackson goes down for Selena's murder. I get my company back and you can do what you like to the man who killed your client. It's an easy call. So, what's more important? The truth or the killer? Because there is literally no way that you can do both. Yes, there is. You can go back and do previous missions after the fact, but that's besides the point. Um, of the two options, this has the cooler ending, and this has the more fulfilling ending. We're going to go with the killer. Also, this music, this song is nuts. Also, one thing they talk about, because there's an actual, like, um, there's an actual, like, dev mode, uh, dev commentary mode in this game, where you can, uh, listen to the devs comment on things. If you listen to them talk about, excuse me, how they did the music in this game, it's amazing. Like, this is the, this is the same version as the song that you, that plays when you, um, when you do missions for Gessler, but it's obviously much more dark okay so let's take a look here i can get in here by going through this window and that's literally it i don't have any other options to get in here 
That's no good. Damn it. Who fired at me? I didn't prank Spasmus gun. Did I? I did. Interesting. Alright, let's restart. I didn't mean to do that, but I guess I did. Mess that up. I can't actually get through that door now. Eh. Hmm. Well, first things first. Let's turn this light off. Because I just don't like lights. Pop this door open. Open every single one of those doors. Turn off those connections. Problem is, this guy's too big for me to actually hit, but I don't need to hit him. Boom. Hi. Bye. Let's deactivate that so that we can do this, because I, as I said, I don't like lights. Big click and ding, and that means that door stays open, which is helpful. Click. Oh, fuck. Didn't realize that door was open. There's nothing I can do about that, is there? That guy's just gonna see me. Hmm. Alright, so there's a laptop over here. Is there a second laptop? I don't think there is. There does not appear to be. I thought this was a laptop, but it is actually not. Okay. I could smash through this window to get down here, but that would require two batteries, which is a lot. But it would let me hack into this. Hmm. That's purple. Actually, that's kind of the only thing I can do. Sorry, nobody heard anything. Apparently. I honestly meant to prank spat or er, to hush cracker that, but I guess that didn't work out as expected. Oh, what? I thought I... Huh? Oh. Disable. Click. Alright. Oh, and I can also do this. Which will also be helpful. And then when that door opens, turn off this light. Click. So I can go through here. Click. See ya. Need to pop that door open. And I guess we can just pop that door open too. So what we're gonna do is open this door and then close that door.
So he's stuck in that room. He can't do anything to bother me now. Actually, I almost fucked that up because he totally tried to use the hand scanner and it worked. From Fritz Gessler to Melanie Cook. Rook. Subject fucked. Hope you enjoyed my little gift to your reception earlier. Guess what? Fucking you again. The money you put in your husband's company, you're never getting that back. I have him by the balls. Any last words before I finish ruining your life and your company? Yeah? Don't uh, count your chickens before they're hatched? Seems like that would be a good one. Wait, I still need to hack that. God damn it. <laughs> good job, Dave. Well, at least we can actually do it. Or not. So now, we just need to do the same thing that we did with the purple door. And, thunk, you're screwed. Hackety, 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 hack. Data wiped. Jackson's going down. Only one laptop, thank God. Is it done? It's done. Fantastic. God, it's been a shitty few days. Thank you for ending it. You can thank me by telling me who killed Selena Delgado. Selena was killed by an agent codenamed Hightower on Gessler's orders. Gessler was blackmailing Jackson to steal from me, but Jackson was planning to run off with Selena and the money. Gessler would have killed them both, but the money was still in Jackson's name, so he took away Jackson's reason to run. I have enough evidence to put Gessler away, but he knows that now. If you don't get him in Hightower tonight, they'll both be gone by the morning. I still have access to Intex comms network. I've killed Hightower to Intex HQ, told him Gessler wants to meet. I strongly recommend you bring a gun, even if you don't intend to fire it. Thanks, I'm off to commit double homicide. Good luck, Richard. Come and fucking get me. Requires gate crashers and the resolver. Good thing that I just got 8,000 fucking dollars. And now it's time for things to go completely off the fucking chain. The gate crashers, you can kick down any conventional door by running into it. Fuck doors. Seriously. Fuck doors. Hey, guess what? Alright. It's probably fine. Alright, I do need to set that to this. You're fine. All right, so you're behind a vault door. Hmm. This is not as easy as it looks. This is like an actual final level too. So you have to actually figure shit out. I've got to get to this terminal. Oh, and this, t this place just goes up forever, fucking ever. So, you know. So we've got this, and I can use this to pop open you, which gets me back downstairs, but how does that help me? Because it kind of doesn't. Boom. Seriously, man. Piano. So good. Oh, wait. Ding, and ding. Click. Bing.
All right, so that lets us hack green doors. Which lets us get up here. Hey, how's it going, buddy? I suppose I could have closed that door and kicked it into him, but eh. Oh, there is a laptop on this level, too. There's a laptop on every level, and it's right there. I need to kill that guy. But I can't open that door yet, because I need to get perp uh, blue, which is over here. Okay. These guys are all bluster. I'm not too worried about them. God damn, the music is so good. Told you, I'll bluster. They'll see me when they come back, but by that time... No, fucking... Thanks, buddy. Ah, oh, Dick. Appreciate your helping me out in that regard. Not what I intended to do, but I'll take it. <laughs> <laughs> fucking knocked out his friends. Oh, that was great. What a dumbass. All right. So now the problem is I have to actually get back into the building. Whee! Alright, so blue, it's still a vault door, so I still have to figure out how to blue it up. Yeah, it's a word, I said it. Now, in theory, I could trigger his gun somehow. Oh, and by the way... I have 60 seconds if I shoot the gun because I help the police chief. If you don't, you have like 15 seconds. So very important to do that if you're interested in doing this mission with the gun. Oh, here we go. Pull this down to here. Set you to... Nope. Other way around. Doom. Ow, my face. Whee! You're dead. They're helping Gessler. I don't really care about you. From Gessler to Encrypted. Subject Collins. What the fuck happened with Collins? That wasn't us, right? I don't think she even had anything. Don't get me wrong, I'm all for simplifying, but unless I was drunker than I remember last night, pretty sure I didn't order this. Could it actually be a legit suicide? Do those even happen? We faked so many, I think I forgot it was a real thing. Yeah, Gessler, you're a fucking piece of work, aren't you? Nope. Boom. Now you might be asking yourself, what's the whole point of... That's Hightower. What's the whole point of doing the... of implicating Jackson in a crime he didn't commit? High tower is the reason that we're doing it. And he's got turbo trousers too. Boom. You can just shoot him right off you, but don't. It's so much better if you keep punching him. Boom. Yeah, he's dead. How fucking cool was that? <laughs> But if you shoot him, it's just he's punching you, he's punching you, he's punching you, and you shoot him, and he dies. 
that way he actually survives. Even though I elbow dropped him from fucking 20 feet up. 500 feet up. You know, whatever the case may be. Um, kill or incapacitate. So, there's a lot of options here. There's a lot of options here. Gessler has a gun. He has a second gun that you can't see. But he has a gun. This light switch will activate a door. Turn that off. This security cam will activate nothing. We use that to go here. That's how you open the door. Your other option is to just fucking gate crash your way into it and kick him out the, the window. In fact, let's try some of these because we can, uh, we can, uh, can we? Yeah, okay, we can. Hey, what's up? Fuck you. That was one. <laughs> Not the most interesting. But we don't want his gun to do anything. So, when pull, the trigger is pulled, this gun will activate a light switch. Well, look at that. Shit hat Conway packs a piece. For your own safety, Fritz, do not insult the hat. You know what? Fuck this. I've seen your record. I know you'll shoot. Good boy. Now drop it. So here's the thing. If you haven't killed anybody in the game, he calls you a pussy and shoots. <laughs> nah, I didn't do that right. Nah, come on. Here we go. Boom! All right, see ya. I killed a lot of people. There was there was quite a bit of murder there. Gunpoint. It's not quite done yet. Ten dead, eighteen injured, twenty jobs, thirteen thousand dollars. I've had better weeks. They don't let me name names on this blog, but the person behind the hit I was investigating is dead now. <laughs> In fact, I may have killed more people than I actually avenged here, which gets you an achievement called Knowledge Ludo Narrative uh, Dissonance. Um, played a dangerous game and he didn't have the cards. Trigger Man's going down. It would have felt good if I hadn't just taken a seven-story body slam. I don't know. I guess I picked the least shitty of two incredibly shitty sides. Maybe that doesn't matter. Maybe all that matters is that I now have the ability to kick down doors. <laughs> Either way, I need to get out of the city. Actually launches your web browser. Um, I'm just going to copy this. And, uh, Jim, do me a favor and put up a link to that there blog post. Thanks, Jim. But yeah, that's, uh, that's Gunpoint. So, short little game. Kind of fun. Um, has some, uh, pretty awesome abilities. And, uh, some interesting puzzles. There is actually a design-your-own-level mode, which is interesting. And, uh, um, you can download levels... And you can download levels and stuff like that. So uh, if you ever get the chance to play this game, it is definitely worth checking out. It is a lot of fun just seeing the stuff that you can pull off. Um, but basically, once I played this game, I knew that I would play anything that these guys put out, which is why I was so into Heat Signature when it came out. Um, and now I'm just waiting for their next game, too, because, you know, that's going to be good. But I don't think Heat Signature is actually done. I think it's an early access. But yeah, so... Short little series, only one to four episodes, kind of like how we did with Need for Speed the Run. But uh, next time on Character Select, I will probably do a longer game. So thank you very much for watching. Make sure to click that like button down below if you liked it. It's subscribe button, bells, you know, all that stuff. And uh, yeah, just remember, when going out for revenge, dig two graves or 
10 and call 18 ambulances. Yeah, it's gonna be good. 